Latest inflation numbers are due out later this morning. Inflation currently stands at 9.1%. Rising prices are certainly making it a challenge for pretty much everybody's budgets, and it's even more difficult for those who are living on a fixed income. WMAR2 News' Mark Roper is live at the Inner Harbor for us this morning. So, Mark, what are some of the ways that seniors can cope with these rising costs? Oh, good morning, Megan. Inflation is definitely putting a squeeze on a lot of household budgets, but there are ways that seniors can save to put a bite in inflation. The rising cost of food, gas, and other necessities make it increasingly difficult for people to make ends meet, but especially seniors living off Social Security. People are deciding whether they can pay their utility bills or buy food. It's just really affecting them. National Council on Aging, Director of Aging and Disability Services, Debbie Spencer, connects seniors with public programs which can help ease their financial burdens. People say, I don't want to take it away from anybody else that really needs it. Well, if you qualify, then you really need it and you need to get it because that's what it's for. The National Council on Aging's Benefits Checkup website offers one-stop shopping for financial assistance with everything from health care and food to transportation and utilities. We do you know, all the applications. We get all the verifications that the administrating agencies need, and they don't have to go anywhere else. We take care of it all, and they tend to get their benefits a lot faster. Such as help paying for health insurance. There's low-income subsidy that would help people with their Medicare D plans, with their copays and their premiums. And prescription drugs. If they're having problems getting their medication, there are applications that you can do through the pharmaceutical companies, and the income is usually 200% of poverty levels. And besides insurance needs, there's a long list of items the National Council on Aging can help seniors gain access to for free, like smartphones, dental care, or vision care. We are fortunate that we have the opportunity to change someone's life just by giving them the knowledge and helping them apply for these public benefits. Now, to find out what senior benefits that you or a loved one might be eligible for, just look for the story on our website, WMAR2news.com. We have a phone number that you can call as well as a link that you can click to check on those benefits. Reporting live at the Inner Harbor, Mark Roper, WMAR2 News. All right, Mark, thank you very much.